Well, tonight, 41 Anxious reporter Jordan Betts introduces us to four local gymnasts hoping to make Team USA. Meet Kara, Leanne, Jeffrey, and Aaliyah. They are all gymnasts at the Gage Center in Blue Springs, but they are not your average gymnast. They are Olympic hopefuls. This particular uh, quadrennium in 2020, uh, we ended up with four athletes who have a, a you know a great chance of making the Olympic uh, trials, mm -hmm. but two actually have a great great chance of making the Olympic team. It's like mind blowing because like I never thought I'd make it this far. Each athlete spends more than 30 hours a week perfecting every jump and dismount. All in hopes to do one thing. Ever since I remember like what the Olympics were, it's like something that's like, okay, that's what I want to do. But this dream comes with sacrifices. From school, we have been having to leave early since like third grade and having to do a bunch of online classes in order to high, uh, graduate from high school. Along with the sacrifices, they faced a waiting game as the Summer Olympics was postponed last year due to COVID-19. It was very devastating to hear that they were going to uh, reschedule it, but um, thinking about it and how we had all that time to progress and upgrade and also recover from like all the injuries that we had, it was just a good step back and a mental reset. Now it's go time. Right now, Kara, Leanne and Aaliyah have qualified to compete at the U.S. Gymnastics Championships. DeFree has to do well at upcoming competitions to qualify, but our coaches, they have no doubt. At championships, a select group of women will be paid to compete at the Olympic trials in St. Louis this summer. For now, these athletes will continue to wait and train until the big day because they all want a chance to be called an Olympian. I know it'll be all worth that in the end. In Blue Springs, Jordan Betts, 41 Action News.